A very good evening folks, welcome back to my channel, Keith here from Commander Hoop Celtic. If this is your first time viewing the channel, please hit that subscribe button below. It helps the channel grow, you don't realise how big it is to me. A thumbs up or a comment below on the video would be fantastic. So, we were sitting second place before the 3 o'clock kick off today, with Rangers being one point ahead. We obviously closed the gap and now we're two points ahead. We maintained our top position. They won 4 0 today, we won. 2-1 against Motherwell. I'd said last night it could have been 4-0, but today it was a sluggish game. We had our chances. We didn't take them. Their keeper, Kelly, had pulled off some cracking saves from Motherwell, and we scored in the 15th minute. Koyogo scored. It was a nice goal. You know, it's great to see a Japanese boy, one of our Japanese boys, scoring, and it means his confidence is flying. Stepped in. Yakamak is out being injured for the game. I thought midfield, we had spells today. I thought our wing-backs played pretty average. Jovanovic hit the crossbar in the first half with a free kick. I thought O'Reilly wasn't on his, his best today. I thought Rio Atate had a pretty pretty good game, to be honest, which is I thought Jota played well before he came off. I thought he was pretty decent today. Um, overall, Maeda had a decent game. Callum McGregor, I know a lot of people are going to say when he got sent off. He took one for the team. It was a bad pass by Rio Atate, I have to say, back to him. But he took one for the team, very similar to what happened with Nier Beaton against Dundee United last season before the Derby game. Very similar. That was a massive part. Like If he got through and we could see that goal, it could have been a two-all draw. We could have dropped, up, dropped points and we would have been second place today. So, crucial. You know, we're going to miss him next week against St. Johnson away, but he's been outstanding. Really has. I thought Joe Hart had a good game. You know, his position in the box, you know, coming out, catching the balls. You know, they they were very, just trump, pinging everything in. Look, it was a stupid goal to give away. I'm really not feeling comfortable about the whole Jens and Welsh partnership there. I know for the time being until Starfelt and Vickers is back, we'll start, we'll start seeing the real business there. But end of the day, I thought Welsh played well. Jens, a bit sluggish at times, but the second half, he digged in, got done. I thought Taylor had a pretty decent game on the left back today. Um, it's good to see Lee Alavada come on. It's great to see that Danish boy as well coming on. Allegard, I thought he played, no, didn't really get much of the ball. It was towards the end of the game. Obviously, Ange done some tactical decisions, bringing on Moy and Allegard in towards the end of the game. Turnbull against his former club. Played all right when he came on as a sub, but... Big game on Wednesday night over in Germany. We need to win these two games against Red Bull, home and away, to, to even have a stamp getting through into the last 16 of the Champions League. If not, we'd be pushing for Europa League place. And look at who would have thought Shakhtar would have been like, you know, second place in the group, doing pretty well. So we took teams for granted. I thought today, Motherwell, they had their chances between the 25th minute up to half time. They did put, cause a bit of pressure on our bus. They had a couple of chances in the second half. But overall, I wasn't happy with Celtics passing in the midfield. I just didn't think we orchestrated ourselves well, especially after the international break. There was a bit of rustiness there, but it's three points. I don't want to moan about it too much. It's three crucial points. I could have been coming on to this tonight saying we drop points. We're top of the league. We move on to St. Johnson next week in domestic football. And we bounced back from the same round result. So who was your best? Who was the best player out there today? Who was your man of the match? What would who would you rate? Comment below and let me know what you think. Hell hell. Have a good Saturday evening. Take care. Up the Celts.